Dear student, now I am going to show you some if condition implementation. Okay, if condition implementation equals to suppose if then open the bracket. After opening the bracket, I am selecting a cell. Suppose this total cell greater than 200 and comma. If it is greater than 200, there should be two conditions. One is uh, true, one is false. See here, one is the true value. It is showing one is true value, one is false value. So true value, I am uh, writing the true value. Suppose pass. Okay, comma, fail. Mm. So let us give enter. The name that has been given that should come within a double inverted comma. Okay, so that has been given. That means there is a formula mistake is there. So if it is so, then within a double inverted comma, the alphabets will going to come. Okay, or it is fail, or it is fail. So error also so i am showing you all this way so that all the error also in front of you you can see it is it clear now what the error you can do at the time of writing at the time of writing you don't give an inverted comma so it will be make your though you have written the thing properly but you will get a zero okay so those the formulas <coughs> should be very much clear to you uh, with this formula, you can uh, use any type of formula, pass or fail formula that uh, if condition you can give. Another if condition I am doing separately here. Let's suppose here, if equals to if, open the first bracket. Suppose I am writing that <coughs> this is what this cell. Suppose I am taking this cell. Okay. If uh, this cell is greater than Okay. okay, comma, then within a double inverted comma, suppose uh, over range. Okay, O V E R over R A N G E range. Close the double inverted comma, close the bracket, enter. Okay, so this is the formula. How to see it? If you go and click on it, you can see the formula. Another uh, way that I'll show you equals to sign after equals to sign go to the insert if see here if condition is there open as soon as you open first logical condition what the logical condition you have to select okay suppose total ah, what value true and value false this logical condition greater than greater than what greater than suppose 100 Okay, then what is the true value? True value suppose pass. Let's say I am not using uh, any inverted comma. See here, P A S S. Let's see what it will show to you because by default it takes those inverted comma. Okay, and fail. Okay, so you click on OK. Fine. So two ways I have shown you by directly giving, uh, directly giving here, or you can uh, use from the insert function option. Okay. So any of this way uh, you can uh, set it. Now another one I am showing you with an if. Suppose if equals to if. Now I am selecting this this one twenty one. This G twelve. If this is equals to suppose equals to i know 21 so i am giving here 21 this is equals to 21 then comma what it will do then it will do that g12 isn't it so g12 g12 then plus with that i am adding suppose this okay now i am closing the bracket Let's see what it do. Here, this way one you can do another formula. You see it nicely equals to if then open the bracket. Suppose G12, G12 equals to 21, comma. Then suppose this plus 100. Let's see. Is it? 
so these are the different way different formula all the main and uh, formulas that i have shown to you and those are the different type of